that the humility of St. Dominic. Humility is the ability to accept the truth of oneself and acknowledge that without God's grace, we can do nothing. It is the ability to know our place in relation to God and created things. St. Dominic expressed the virtue of humility in his prayer. Dominic prayed earnestly for whatever graces he needed to do his ministry. His first of nine ways of prayer evidenced this. In prayer, he bowed humbly before the altar, before Christ his head, considering his severe condition and outstanding nobility of Christ. St. Dominic insisted on the study for members of the order because concerning knowledge, no one has it all. It takes humility to acknowledge that the more we know, the more we discover our insufficiency and are motivated to continue to seek for the truth. St. Dominic knew he does not have the whole truth and for this reason, he spent time at the feet of Jesus in contemplation so as to give the fruit of his contemplation to others. Another thing to note of St. Dominic's humility is the fact that he adopted a new mode of the mission. St. Dominic believes that the Abigeson can be converted by an example of humility more than the display of words or verbal battle. This prompted him to adopt mendicancy as style of life for himself and the members of his order. After five years of papal recognition of the order, Father Dominic conveyed a chapter. In this chapter, he stipulated that the chapter ranks as the highest unit of government. He invariably became subject to the authority of the chapter. This initiative is new to the religious life at this time. Most time, abbots were superiors for life and wield extensive power. In addition to his decision, he resigned when he saw that he was becoming weary in leading his brothers, although the brothers refused. It takes great humility to acknowledge one's incapability as most leaders who want to hold on to authority when they are no longer capable of doing such service. All this points to the fact that St. Dominic was humbled. Conclusively, as we pray and prepare for the Feast of St. Dominic, we pray that we obtain for us, he obtains for us, the true gift of humility, especially at this novena. Alleluia.